Downing the box in 1937 lives forever in my memory because as a young eight-year-old, it was the first big game of rugby I'd ever seen. My father took me there and we sat in the Sheridan stand. Uh, fortunately, we're in the stand because it was raining cats and dogs. The time uh, when the game was on, I was eight-year-old and my dad for years always had his little New South Wales Rugby Union membership badge, which he would show to come through the gate. So I was here with my dad. It was a very wet day. It was a very cold day. Uh, and the cricket ground was very, very muddy, as it often was after rain in those days. But the important thing that I remember was that time and again, people would stand up because New South Wales were doing so well against the box and I couldn't see. I'd stand on the seat and still couldn't see. They were an unbeaten team, by the way. Nobody had ever beaten the 36 and 37 Springboks. This is why this game is very significant. The, the coach was Johnny Wallace, the great 27-28 uh, 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 Waratah captain. Having come from that team, of course, the only one way to play was the 1927-28 style. And that was really uh, what won the game for us. Johnny Wallace, the coach, had said, come on, boys, play it as though it's a dry day. And they did that, and that's how they beat the box. But the Waratahs beat them in the mud at the Sydney Cricket Ground in 1937. And they'd be dad alongside me, screaming as loudly as I was. It's definitely a privilege. The guys that have played that long ago, we've got their names on the jersey, which will obviously mean a lot. Um, and it's just good, good to get back to your roots. It sort of gives you the knowledge that there is a history behind you and there's a proud history behind you. The lifetime supporters, the guys that have, have been through the thick and thin, they, they will appreciate it the most.